guys, what's up? Today I'm here to bring you two really exciting announcements. So the first announcement is that I will be participating in NaNoWriMo this year for the first year. I'm really frightened by NaNoWriMo and I definitely probably won't hit my 50,000 word goal, but I'm gonna try. College might interfere, things with my shop might interfere, general life might interfere, but we're gonna give it a go. If you don't know what NaNoWriMo is, NaNoWriMo stands for National Novel Writing Month, and it is the entire month of November. The goal for the people participating in NaNoWriMo is to write 50,000 words or a small novel in the span of this month. Now, the idea is that you are just starting a novel at the beginning of November, and then the months of December, January, and February, I believe, are all editing and revising months where we can edit each other's things and help each other out with some development and things that might need to happen to help progress our novels into being full-blown wonderfulness. So my concept for NaNoWriMo, and I'm still working on a title, so for now the title is The Wall. That will not be the end title. And the description is the main character Brogan lives in a city surrounded by giant walls and the only rule that the citizens know of is that they are not allowed to leave the wall and no one is allowed to enter wall, the name of the city currently. However, one day when Brogan is working in the field, she discovers a hole in the wall and the only thing she now knows is that she needs to get out and survive and figure out a way to adventure into what is beyond wall. It's going to be young adult dystopian slash adventure slash funness kind of. So I'm really excited and I will leave a link in the description box as to where you can find my NaNoWriMo page. If you would like to become my writing buddy, please, please, please do. I will need all of the encouragement I can get and I would love to help other people with NaNoWriMo this year. So, awesome. The second announcement that I have for you guys is a readathon announcement. Ooh, confetti! Imaginary confetti! I am one of the hosts for the Winter Rereadathon, which was started on Goodreads by Alma from Diary of a Book Lover, and between myself, Alma, and Anna from Unquenchable Reads, the three of us will be hosting this Rereadathon, and it will occur from the 22nd of December to the 2nd of January. The idea behind this readathon is that it is a rereadathon, so you get to reread some of the books that you've loved in the past and experience them all over again. Especially during this time, it might not be the perfect time to start a new book because Christmas, that you're going to be getting a crap ton of new books your way. So, rereadathon, reread the books you love, and wait until you get all of your new books to decide what wonderful good newness things you would like to participate in. The readathon will be hosted between my blog, Rooftop Reads, Alma's blog, Diary of a Book Lover, and Anna's channel on YouTube, which is Unquenchable Reads, and I will leave links in the description box to all three of those places so you guys can check it out. There is a sign up on Alma's blog, which I will leave a link to as well down there. And then on top of all of that wonderful goodness, there is also a Goodreads page for said group where you can introduce yourself and get to know some of the other wonderful people participating in the readathon. So I will leave a link to that in the Dropbox as well. Holy links, Batman. Holy links. All right, so those are all of the announcements that I have for you guys today. Leave a comment down below with your favorite book that you might reread during the winter rereadathon, and I will definitely have more updates to come with the winter rereadathon. And check out Anna's channel as well, as she will be posting updates once we get closer to the actual readathon itself. I'm so excited, I can't even word. Ah. Otherwise, until next time, guys. Bye. We read a thun. We read a thun. I'm gonna die in November. I'm gonna die in November. Ah. Screams of terror and panic begin now.